So I'm watching Rick and Morty right now, and I realized, so a while ago, let me get it up, a while ago I did a look that was kind of like Rick and Morty themed on my Instagram, and I never took a video of it, and I also like messed up a few things that like, because I had it all planned out, and I kind of had to change it because like things didn't fit and whatever, so I am going to try it again and see what freaking happens. And I'm gonna maybe, I don't know, I might do some different stuff. But yeah, and now you guys get to see how I did it also and how I did kind of an updated version of it. And I'm also gonna sit here and watch the show while I do it. I don't know. I don't know why that matters, but yeah, I'm gonna sit here and watch the show and do some Rick and Morty makeup, watching some Rick and Morty because honestly, I've seen like every episode. I'm a big fan. It's a funny show. And yeah, I'm just gonna get going. Um, I feel like I should say some stuff. Check out my Instagram if you haven't where that picture is. It's at Maddie Carp Makeup. Check that out. And don't forget to hit that subscribe button because there's more videos to come and you're gonna wanna see them. So also hit that notification bell because that way you'll know right when they're out. So yeah, I'm gonna get into this right now. So I'm starting out with some clean hands and my Maybelline primer. Um, so this is actually funny. I didn't do this on purpose, but right now I'm actually watching like the first episode of Rick and Morty I ever watched, which is the interdimensional cable episode. And I was like at a friend's house and it was on and it was like in the middle of one of the episodes and I was like, what is this show? Like what is even happening? Like there is no logic, what is happening? <laughs> and then I like got interested so I kept watching and kind of realized what was going on. And I thought it was super funny and I got super into it and I think I watched I went on like Adult Swim and they have like a live stream that just repeats the whole series like constantly and I think I probably finished it within a few weeks and probably shorter than that. Um, it was just so good and yeah it's super funny and if you haven't seen it or if you just haven't even seen that episode make sure to check it out. Going in with my Born This Way foundation and I actually got a new Eco Tools sponge. And it's a really nice sponge. Honestly, I've had the Beauty Blender, I've had the Real Techniques sponge. This works just as nice as both of those. And yeah, I've been using these over both of those. So go check these out. I think you can get them to Target, Ulta, probably anywhere. And I'm just doing a base, honestly. So like, cause I'm gonna do some makeup around my face and I want it to have something to stick to and blend on so i'm gonna do a nice foundation base and i got foundation in my hand i turned myself into a pickle morty boom big reveal i'm a pickle all right now i'm just gonna conceal with my tarte shape tape which is the one thing i forgot to bring out here okay and I'm gonna go get that and then I'm gonna also just set my face and probably do some light like bronzing and contouring but not a lot because I don't want that to take away from what else is going on in my face. Szechuan sauce, Szechuan sauce, and it's delicious, and it's delicious. Szechuan sauce, Szechuan sauce, and it's delicious, and it's delicious. Szechuan sauce, Szechuan sauce. So now I'm going to go in with this e.l.f. blush, actually, it's this neon pink color. Laser guns and jetpacks and a space tank 
laser guns and jetpacks. Look at these dead flies. Laser guns and jetpacks. Okay, now that I have a pink forehead, I'm gonna go in with purple. Um, I'm not sure quite yet which what. Bleh. Not sure which purple to go in with yet. I have a few different ones, and they're not really the color I want. So, might have to mix. We'll see. <laughs> of the Szechuan sauce, like as much as you're allowed to give me, as much as you're allowed to give me, as much as you're allowed to give me, Szechuan sauce, Szechuan sauce, and it's delicious. Okay, so I didn't know I wasn't recording, but apparently I wasn't. I used some white liquid lipstick to add a few dots for the stars, and then I started a concealer like circle for the base of my portal. So I'm going to get going on that. Okay, so I mixed a bunch of colors on my hand and came up with the blue I think will work. I don't have like the color I need. I only have like a greeny blue and like I just a dark blue and it's it's not the color I need. I just need like an aqua light blue but I don't have one so I made, I think I made it on my hand. And I'm gonna use a really small paintbrush and start get going, start get going. Start on Rick's hair on my, but my eyebrow. I just realized that I have not done my eyebrows and I don't know what to do. I really don't feel like doing them. They take so long. So for right now, I'm going to not do them. And I'm going to start on Rick's hair, but my eyebrow. wants to go run in a stream. What the f No! I want to be alive! I am alive! Alive, I tell you! Mother, I love you! I want to hold you! I want to run in a stream! I want to be alive! I am alive! Alive, I tell you! Mother, by passing over, I hold you! I want to run in a stream! Okay, so I really didn't like the color this ended up being, and so I mixed up a bunch more colors. And so originally I mixed up this like corrective concealer with just white and it gave me this but I needed it to be more like blue and so I literally like scraped off one of my eyeshadows and mixed it in with some white and that green and got this color. So yeah, I'm gonna try to fix this crap. Okay, that is so much more the color I wanted. Like it's actually blue colored like his hair is. I don't know if the camera like kind of whites it out and makes it look not as colored, but it's definitely more the blue color I wanted. So, whoop the freaking do. Um, I think the next thing I'm gonna move on to is maybe the eyes. I don't know, I don't really know what I'm feeling. you got okay now that there's glass
glitter everywhere. <laughs> um, I'm gonna do Rick's drool right here. So I'm gonna mix this like white clear glitter and this silver glitter and decorate my forehead with it. done I think I have blown through so many episodes of Rick and Morty honestly I know I at least started on season one I'm currently on season two episode nine <laughs> um but yeah this is the look um I hope you guys liked it or liked watching me do it because I know I already did a video or did a, not a video I did a look like this that I posted on my Instagram and a few other places but I remember when I did it there was a few things I wanted to do differently at first and I remember it being a really fun look to do so I wanted to try it again I don't know I just I really like Rick and Morty I wanted to watch it today and I kind of wanted to find like a makeup look to do around it so I could just chill and watch it and just kind of relax watch Rick and Morty and do makeup about Rick and Morty too but yeah cause I'm just like chilling while hanging out it's super hot outside but i'm chilling in a sweatshirt inside <laughs> doing my makeup yeah i just i haven't honestly i've not felt like doing my makeup lately at all like even the phone looks i just honestly haven't felt like it um but today i really felt like it and yeah i don't really know what i'm even talking about now i guess just trying to say like not every video is going to be a crazy makeup look but i do still want to do them because i do still enjoy them it's just kind of right now i'm doing them whenever i'm like oh i want to do that <sighs> i don't know i just really felt like doing my makeup today so yeah what was i saying i feel like there's so many things i have to say at the end of these but i always forget oh Mixing these colors were kind of a bitch, but I found out that you can just scrape some of your eyeshadow and mix it with some creams and get the color you need, because honestly, I'm pretty proud of the color of Rick's hair, because I've been watching it all day. I kind of really want to make sure it was the right color. I feel like, because when I'm looking at it in the viewfinder right now, it doesn't look like the right color, but then when I look in the mirror, it looks like the right color. So I hope it kind of shows up on screen as the right color. And also his like drool, it's kind of cracking because I didn't set it because I didn't have a color to set it with. And it's also just like a concealer slash corrector color from NYX. So I don't know if it's really meant to be like a painted color on your face more than just kind of a corrector underneath concealer or foundation but it was the right color so I used it make do with what you have so I hope you guys all want to go out and watch Rick and Morty right now because I've been watching it this whole time and honestly I want to keep watching it but I haven't watched it like actually in a while like I haven't watched a lot of the episodes in a while now so so I don't know I've just been enjoying watching them now um, also, I geek out at Rick and Morty memes. Like, I don't know how, but I was on Pinterest, and somehow I think I found like one random like Rick and Morty meme and started scrolling, and there was this like plethora I don't know if that's the right word plethora of uh, Rick and Morty memes on Pinterest. And I was like, is this some like undiscovered like community of Rick and Morty fans on Pinterest, or like what's going on? <laughs> I have no idea, but 
they were some funny things. But yeah, I'm gonna stop talking. I don't really know what I've been talking about. I'm pretty much rambling. I hope you guys liked this look. I hope you guys like seeing how I did it. Um, what is in my hair? Is that glitter? Yup. Um, I kind of want to try to make some more of these more casual, like me sitting down actually talking to you guys, not voicing over, even though I literally am like talking to you and then just doing it. I kind of have to do that so I don't talk too much because otherwise I will literally talk the entire time and it'll be a 40 minute video. We'll see how long this video is going to be, but I'm kind of trying to get better at talking enough but not talking too much. So... Yes, I am trying to do some more of these more casual sit down, hanging out with me type videos. So I hope you guys like them. Let me know. Make sure to give this video a thumbs up if you liked it. If you're a Rick and Morty fan, if you've never seen Rick and Morty but you just appreciate the content, thank you. Yeah, make sure to hit that subscribe button, that notification bell to make sure that you know when my video is out so you can be VIP and get in there right away. Um, also, I mean, I shouldn't really say that you're VIP. You're not. I mean, you're all IPs. Everyone's an IP. But you just get notified that my video is out right when it, right when it gets out. So you can be one of the most first. You can be one of the most first people. You can be one of the first people to see it. So, yes. Also, what else did I have to say? Make sure to check out my Instagram, at Makeup. Oh, I forgot. Leave any comments, requests, say hey, I don't care, leave a comment, whatever. <laughs> um, I hope you guys have a good day. Thank you so much for watching my videos, this video specifically. Thank you so much, and I will see you guys on the next one.